everybody, Ace Trainer Liam here and welcome to the latest episode of the Pokemon Sun Wonder Trivia Lock. We're on Route 2, heading towards the next part of the story, and there's a cutie fly, that's adorable. Answering the question of the day, which is going to be a nice, easy one. What's your favourite new Alola Pokemon? I'm not going to answer it this time, because i got an upcoming top 5 that you guys are going to find the answer out in. Hint, hint, hint. But here we go, let's, let's lick the cutie fly to death. Paralyze it, that's good news. It's still gonna, ooh, it's still gonna absorb, but that's not gonna do a lot because we're part poison type. Well done, cutie fly. Enjoy that one HP. Oh, may maybe more than one. We're gonna take it out. Dead easy, dead easy. Down it goes. So, we're finally getting some momentum going, progressing in the story, which is beautiful. Who's level 10? Is that my Crabrawla? I should probably put my Crabrawla at the front, to be honest. There's one of those evil Pokemon that wants to jump out at us, and I, I'm, I'm not feeling it. I'm going to go with the Repel. He's still going to catch us, so we've got to run real fast, but no other Pokemon will be able to get us. That's that's a given. It's a Makuhita. Now, we know for a fact Makuhita can't really do anything against us, so we're in a, we're in a pretty good position. Oh, and the good news is I've got new questions that I can add to the uh, the big bank of trivia, which is good. Some people have finally come through with their questions. Thank you, by the way, to the uh, YouTubers that I reached out to that sent me through questions. That's, that's absolutely fine, and I appreciate that not everybody would have time to do it. But thank you especially to the YouTubers that I contacted, friends of mine that I contacted, that read my message saying, hey, would you mind doing this for me, and didn't respond. That's really, really helpful, and I really appreciate, like, I don't know, maybe I'm old-fashioned, but maybe a, a little, oh, sorry, I, I don't really have the time, but thanks for thinking of me. Maybe, maybe that would have been appreciated, but no, 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 a flat-out no reply, that's that's absolutely fine. Thank you, guys. Wee oui, wee, oui, it's a battle, a battle! Although special thanks goes out to, I would say, Spectre, Super Nerd Daniel, Tony Daddy, and True Green 7, who literally, boom, at the drop of a hat, were like, yeah, give me a few minutes, I'll bang you some questions over. Good guys. Subscribe to them all. Let's see. We'll lick it, we'll lick it. I should nightshade it, really. I mean, how much HP does a cute flight level 9 really have? Stun Spore, you little bugger. All right. If that's how it's going to be. Let's go for the nightshade. Let's see if we can kill you. Ooh. All right. All right. Not very effective. Here comes the nightshade. And down it goes. Ooh. Didn't like that. There we go. Beautiful. Right. Now I need to unpower... Wait. Isn't there a Pokemon Center right here? I'm not going to... Oh, there he is. What's he got for us? How's it, Liam? Your Pokemon doing all right? Yeah, fine. Well, I know my team's seen better days, that's for sure. Mm-hmm. Come on, Liam, let's stop by the PMC. Don't call it that. Don't, don't. I hate you, Hal. A little bit more every day. You know that Verdant Cavern place? I guess it's kind of like sacred to Tapu Coco. You aren't even allowed to go in unless you're on your island challenge. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. I have something pretty amazing to share with you, Liam, you lucky thing. Thanks for the revives. I'm going to sell them right now. Revives are solid items to have. If your Pokemon faints in battle and can't go on, then revive will perk them right back up. But you probably won't find revives here. Did you know that Pokemon sometimes sell different things? And not just that, the two clicks of the counter even sell different things from one another. I think I'll get myself a treat at the cafe to pump myself up before trying the trial. Okay, that's that's wonderful, dude. Let's heal up. By the way, if you're enjoying the Ace Trainer Liam logo t-shirt, you can get them at the t-shirt link in the description. I mainly say it because like, I want to meet a bunch of you guys at Summer in the City and at WinCon later this month. And uh, it'd be awesome if I could meet you guys and you'll be wearing shirts from my store. That'd be so weird for me. <laughs> If you give Pokemon berries to hold, they can see them without them whenever they need in battle. Okay, mechanics, thank you. Hello, you're a Pokemon trainer, aren't you? have caught Spearow. Would you trade it for my matchup? I haven't caught a Spearow. And I don't want your matchup either. This is a wonder trivial up, come on. Hey, have you a moment? You look in Alola. I've got a favourite test, do you mind? No problem. Uh, a request for a total stranger. She wants to see Cutie Fly. Okay. 
That, that's fine. Okay. I, I will do. Oh no, oh no, oh no. I don't, I don't need your info. Whenever I'm sleeping, my Oricorio comes in at some point and falls asleep on my tummy. Oh, that's kind of cute actually. Right, we need to do some shopping real quick. What have you got? You've got luxury balls and nest balls and super potions. Okay. Super potions? This early? I mean, sure. And you've got regular potions because you're weird. I mean, Pokeballs, we've got 33 of those. I, I'm going to go to the other guy. He's got better stock. I'm going to sell some stuff. So let's see. <clears throat> what can we get rid of? We can get rid of those revives, of which we have five. Wow, that's good news. Ether, Paralyze, Heal, Awakening, Potion, blah, blah, blah. Big mushrooms. We have two of those. That's another five grand. We are rolling in it today, people. X defense, I don't need. X attack, I don't need. And the, oh, okay, that's enough. That's enough <laughs> selling. Anything else I could do for you? I would love to buy some super potions. In fact, I would like to buy twenty of them. And then let's get ourselves. It doesn't really matter what Pokeball we catch things in, actually, because. Have you got any... Wait, has this, has this place got any uh, super repels? I really like super repels. No, just regular repel. You know what? Let's get ten of those, just because we can. And do we need to stock up on paralyzed heals? Yeah, we do. One, two, three. Always make sure you have ten of everything, and you'll never run out. I don't, I don't want ten of those, though. Okay, let's leave. Repel War Off. I don't, I don't need it to continue. I love, that's a small feature that is often overlooked in Pokemon. The fact that you can ask Repels to uh, continue. Pokemon move lands a critical hit. It will deal 50% more damage. Thank you, sir, for that ever-loving information. Boy, if only the water in the sea was Soda Pop. Then I could heal my Pokemon. Wait, what route is this? I've forgotten. I'm going to go back in and back out again. Because this might be a new route. And if it's a new route, it means new Pokemon. It, it didn't tell me. It actually didn't tell me. Hey, he wants to fight. I didn't know that. Is there an item around here? Wait a tick. There is an item around here. It's a rev... Oh, bloody revive. <laughs> okay, let's fight this guy. Hey, chump. I'm looking for berries to have my Pokemon hold. Yeah, yeah, hold my berries. Yo, yo, hold my berry a second. Nice tash, Jay. Wow, he's got a Butterfree, though. That's kind of terrifying. As long as it doesn't know confusion, we'll be all right. Just use Nightshade. Take it out real quick. Come on. That's like half its HP. It's using Gust. That's not a problem. Ooh, okay. We can do this. It's not an issue. Down goes Butterfree. Yeah, down goes Butterfree. Lovely. Good stuff. And we're level 17. I really need to put my Crabrawler at the front. Although I, I feel like Crabrawler is going to be another one that goes in the PC when we catch another Pokemon. That's good. Everyone's getting levels up, though. That's what we like. Because I don't think Crabrawler is going to be a mainstay of our team all the way up to Mount Larnaquila. What's, what's, isn't there a path down this way? No, it just looks like there is. All right. I want to know what route I'm on. I, I thought I was on route two, but... Wait. Oh, I can't go to route three yet? I'm confused. Oh, that looks like another route. Right, we got berries. We got chest, though. You can just check the Rotom decks for what route you're on, you idiot. Cool. Chesto berry again. Lovely. Okay, Rotom, what route am I on? Yep, I, I don't, I don't, I don't need your, your, your info. Can I view the map, please? We are currently on route two. Route three is that bit up there. Okay, that, that's fine. Okay, so not a new route. And we can't catch Pokemon until the trial's over, so we'll go talk to Ilima. Greetings, Captain Illima here, earning my trial! That's the Illima voice. Begins mere steps from here in Verdant Cavern. 
Note that the Pokemon living within the Verdant Cavern are quite fierce. I wouldn't venture in unless you prepared for potions and so forth. Through attempting the trials during the island challenge, one can exceed his or her own limits. That's what the Alolan people believe. Once you enter Verdant Cavern, you will not be able to leave until you complete the trial. Are you prepared? Yes. Let me in. I'll be waiting for you. That's fine. I want to defeat you. In we go. Jolly good. It's beautiful. Remember seeing this in the trailer and just thinking, wow, this is Alola. Crazy, right? Let me formally welcome you to Verdant Cavern. I am your Captain Illima. Allow me to explain the basics of my trial. What you should attempt to do is... Beat a gumshoes. A young goose. It's so cute. Defeat three of the Pokemon that lurk here in their dens. Okay. Then reach the pedestal deep within the, 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 the cave and collect the Z crystal there. You'll need to be completely in sync with your Pokemon to succeed. Oh yeah, and there's a really angry Pokemon there. <clears throat> oh dear, and there's one more thing I forgot to mention. Yeah, forgot to mention. Many strong Pokemon make their home in this cave, but one stronger and more fearsome than all the rest, known as a totem Pokemon, resides here. It'd be the greatest obstacle to face as you attempt to clear my trial. Wonderful. By the way, to clear the trial, not be able to catch a Pokemon. Okay, that's fine. Okay, seven trials. Fantastic. Let me go. It begins now. The trial of Captain Illima. Sweet. I'm ready. I want to go and get that, that TM. That's all I care about. Item. Do, 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 hey, got me. Wonderful, right. So let's kill Young Goose. Easy peasy. Actually, not easy peasy, because we've got a Ghastly in the front of the party, which can't do anything. That's not good. Let's switch Pokemon. Actually, our Crabrawla will be pretty good in this trial, so we'll use him for now. Oh, sand attack. <clears throat> Come on, Crabrawler, you got this. Look at that booty. Come on, Rock Smash avoided. Leer, okay. He could have issue. Come on. Rock Smash. Just as I was talking about getting rid of him from the party, we kind of need to put him at the front. Well done, Crabrawler. Still two more to defeat. That's fine. So, Crabrawler, go to the front, please. So, there is a TM down here. I don't want to jump any further down. Ooh, brick break. Just what we needed. Who can learn brick break? Uh, brick break, brick break, brick break, brick break. Pangoro can learn it. Wait, Karate Chop has 50 base power. Critical hits land more easily. But this is always like... Yeah, that, that's better. 75 base power is better than 50 base power with a chance of crit. And we'll give it to you. And you'll just learn it because, you know... Why not, eh? Why not? So we need to head across here. There's another one. But first I'm going up here because I want to squeeze through here and get this item. Nothing like a super potion. Small den. Will I look inside? Yes. Nothing inside because he's over there. How about now? I don't want to go up there. Oh, but you must. You must go up there. Hello. Now you're over the other end, right? Oh, it's all connected like a series of tunnels. Aren't we supposed to fight one near the entrance and we've just skipped it? Yeah, let's look inside. Oh, come on, mate. Don't do this. There's an X defense. That's wonderful. Okay, we need to go back over. Do, 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 do. I think if we... Oh, okay. Team Skull. Yo, 
yo, yo. It's your berry thief boys back, back again. Remember us? Sorry, who are you? <laughs> Beautiful. Oh, I see. Just because we switched places, you can't tell who we were anymore. Brilliant. Who cares about that anyway? We're here to mess this trial up, yo. Indeed. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yo, let's get that Pokemon, homie. They're brilliant. Okay, let's fight them. Let's take down Team Skull again. Here we go. Hello, Mr. Grunt. Drowsy. No biggie there. Uh oh. Actually, he could be a biggie. What level is he now? He's level 11. Mm, we, we don't want to face Drowsy with this guy. You're right. So we need to switch to something tougher. Let's go to Herdia. Herdia can do it. Sweet. There's the pound. Okay. Let's go for a bite. That should be a one shot. Easily. There we go. Jobs are good. Hell yeah. And we beat the Team Skull Grunt. I wonder when our Magikarp's going to evolve. That's, it's taken a while. What's up with that? For real though, I can't get my skull around it. This kid's mad strong, yo. No, I ain't even like this. This kid is straight up dangerous, homie. I don't know, man. Isn't this whole place trouble? Yeah, it totally is, homie. I mean, thing is, that thing is so strong, regular Pokemon don't even want to come out and battle. Yep. They've, they've done a runner. Oh, I hate that. Do you know what? That actually made me jump a little bit. Yo, kid, you know there's a mad strong Pokemon lurking back here somewhere, right? I'd run if I were you. Nah, we're not going out like that. We've got to get our revenge. Go stand in that den and catch that skulking young goose, yo. For real? Fine. Got no bones to pick with you. I hate that. I hate that he just comes back. So, is the other young goose at this den? I can't remember. Never remember. Come on, young goose. There he is. Okay, let's battle him. It's gumshoes. That's not good. But we're going to kill it, so it's not going to be an issue. Yeah, it's level 11, but we're level 12 with Brick Break. There you go. Easy. And good experience from a gumshoes as well. That's the one good thing about them. Level 13. Sweet. Wants to learn Pursuit? I mean, that's fine, just in case we get stuck against some kind of psychic thingamabob. Although, why would it want to switch out? There you go. And the rest of the Pokemon didn't level up. Beautiful. Still one more Pokemon to defeat. There's nothing in that... I think it's down near the entrance. Because <clears throat> we normally face one there, and... and I didn't face one earlier, so let's go check it out. Right here. Yes, I'll look inside. There it is! Why did it say no me? That's not really a, a, a young goose kind of thing to say, is it? <clears throat> here we go. So one little brick break and we'll be all good. There we go. Oh, nearly leveled up again. Defeated all the Pokemon. Wonderful. Oh. Okay, now we need to head up to the cavern to go and get our Z-Crystal. Stupid Team Skull Grunts. I love them. I love them. I think they're great. They're hilarious. Fantastic! You've proved your strength to all three Pokemon. Then go right ahead inside. Oh, I shall. Because I want to catch something in the Verdant Cavern and wonder trade it for something crazy cool to replace my Crabrawler. You feel a piercing gaze that seems to cut right through you, but from where? Will you take the Sea Crystal from the pedestal? Yes, indeed. Not yet, though. Oh, no! It's Donald! 
is not happy. China, 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 China. Uh oh. Gotta defeat him. You don't have the stamina. China. Here we go. Okay, Gumshoes. His defense rose, but that's fine. We're gonna brick break him anyway. Do it. Go on, knock him out in one. Go on, go on, go on, go on, go on, go on. Oh, so close. He used scary face and lowered my speed. Now he called for help because he's getting bodied. China! There he is. There's a little gumshoes, young goose, whatever they're called. I don't even care. More boring normal type Pokemon. Did I just select? Oh, I selected the one on the left, I think. Ooh, he's leering. Okay, gotta be careful. Ooh, that tackle, though. Ooh, that tackle, though. Okay, I didn't mean to take out Young Goose. I meant to take out Gumshoes. There we go. Level 14. That's good, though. Anyone else? Nope. Oh, he's not actually going to call for help, so we are going to win on this turn. That's brilliant. Ooh, that not very effective bite, though. Here's the Rock Smash, and it's all over. Down goes Gumshoes. Give me enough experience, please. 517. Someone's level 18. Well done. We beat Totem Gumshoes. Gumshoes disappeared back into the cave somewhere. What an incredible trainer you are! For you to be able to defeat the po Totem Pokemon that I trained up to such a powerful state, I don't know what to say. Working in harmony with your Pokemon, you've cleared the trial of Illima. You're a phenomenal trainer. Congratulations. The Z-Crystal from the pedestal is yours now. I want it. And we got our first Z-Crystal. The Normalium Z. Beautiful. You can't spell Normalium without Liam. Well, you can, because it's a different spelling, but still. We got it. We got it, and that's what matters. So now we can use crazy normal type Z moves and status moves and stuff. Sweet. What you've just received is the normal Z crystal. It's known as Normalium Z. Now, if you let a Pokemon who that can use a normal type move hold that. Yep, and do that crazy action. And strike an elegant pose like this one, then you'll be able to strengthen a normal type move by unleashing Z power. Sweet. Moving right along. Ah yes, there's one thing I forgot to mention. The Totem Pokemon. Every locale where a captain holds his or her trials will encounter a particularly strong Pokemon, like Gumshoes just now. And during battles against such Pokemon, they may summon allies to show up their offense. It's not a tactic often seen in other regions. Perhaps Pokemon and Lola are simply more inclined to help one another. Since you managed to feed the Totem Pokemon and proved yourself, you can now try to catch the Pokemon you find here in this cave. In fact, have some great balls. Thank you. And here, let me see your Pokemon. Oh, see to your Pokemon after all the hard work. So he's going to heal our Pokemon. Fantastic. Lovely. If we're done here, I have something interesting I'd like to show you. Come with me to Route 3. No, I want to I wanna catch something here. Um, oh, I don't have Tauros yet. Remind me when I have Tauros to come back and get the TM here. Because no doubt I'll forget. Here we go. So we're going to catch this Pokemon... And then we're gonna one. We're gonna do some trivia after we catch it. Another Zubat. Well, that's good news because it means I can do some not very effective moves on it. Actually, let's just use Bubble. Don't kill it. Don't kill it. Okay, that's fine. Zubat's gonna use Absorb. I mean, oh, that's annoying because that's gonna <laughs> it's gonna restore its HP. Damn it. Okay, let's use Pursuit. Don't kill it. Don't kill it. Don't kill it. Oh my god. Okay, use Supersonic. We're going to catch it this turn. Don't call for help. Not now. Thank you. And let's just use a Pokeball because it's only a Zubat. And then we'll get ready to do some trivia. Come on. Come on. And I'm going to replace Ariados because, I mean, so far we've not used it. So it can live in the PC for now. Hey, Crabrol is level 15. We'll keep him for a while. Why not? 
Would I like to give Zubat a nickname? Yes. And I've got my tweet at the ready. So we'll call him Ace. And hopefully you guys are ready. Please select a Pokemon to swap from your party. Yeah, I feel like I'm not going to use Ariados that much. So I'm going to swap out Ariados. That's going to go to the PC. Now then, we've caught a Pokemon, so we need to do some trivia. I need to remember to do this in the right order. So, we'll go to our random number generator. Generate a number. We got 75. And... 75 is from Tony Daddy. Which of the following regions is Norman originally from? Okay, Norman is is the Petalburg City gym leader in Pokemon Ruby and Sapphire. Um... Is he from Kanto, Johto, Hoenn, or Sinnoh? Now, they moved to Hoenn from Johto, I believe. So, I'm going to go with B, Johto. B, and of course it's right. We all know it's right. That was an easy one. Thank you for the credit, Tony Daddy. Much appreciated. Festival Plaza. I would like to a Wondery Trade. Let's connect to the internet. Beautiful. I'm going to highlight that so I can edit later. Where's it gone? See, this is why I need to highlight. Connecting to the internet. Beautiful. Now, someone suggested yesterday on Twitter that when I, if I fail to answer a trivia question right, I should have to release the Pokemon that I just caught. So, like, the Zubat, for example. Do you guys think that should be a rule? Because that's kind of harsh, but it makes sense. So what we got? We're going to get rid of Ace. So I'm ready on the button. Trade and tweet. There we go. Lovely. So we're going to see if any of you got lucky enough to send me something in place of my Zuba, I hope it's something good. I hope it's worth switching Ariados out. Well, it is, because Ariados won't listen to us. It's way too high a level. So anything is better than that right now, at this stage of the game. What we got? Anything? Ooh, we got name I can't pronounce from Japan. Says, Guten Tag, can I cry? <laughs> okay, whatever you say. See you later, little Zubat. Please be good. Please, I'm begging you. Here's the big reveal. Pawniard. I mean, it's interesting. Just don't get hit by any fighting type moves. Don't bring him out against Hala. Okay, I can I can deal with the Pawniard. That's fine. Do you know what? We'll, we'll use him. That's interesting. And I assume he's like level one though. Sweet, let's back out and check him out. Oh, wicked. Little Pawniard. So, if we go to our Pokemon. Check out our... Yeah, it's level 1. Hey, but it's got Sucker Punch, Psycho Cut, and Revenge. So, we've got some egg moves on there, I believe. Its ability is Defiant. So, if anyone, if anything lowers... A stat by it, it will in get increased attack. Its special attack has been lowered in favor of attack, so it has an adamant nature. This, this, thank you very much, is a good Pawniard. Thank you very much. Wowza. Jolly good. Shame we can't check its IVs yet, but that's okay. Right. Oh boy. Okay. Well, Pawniard's going to get some levels up now. That's a given. Oh, I'm happy with that, though. Yeah, just yeah, just don't let him get hit by any fighting type moves at all. Let's go for a rock smash on Young Goose. And there we go. Easy. Here we go, Pawniard. Oh, heard he is level 19. Pawniard's level 2. Level 3. Level 4. 5. Six. Oh god. Wants to learn what? No, don't learn Leer. Have you seen the moves you've got? Well done, Pawniard. Right, we need to get out of here real quick. We'll probably get attacked by a Diglett or something crazy. Nope, just a Zubat. But you know what? I think we can take Zubat down really easily. So let's do it. 
Because we need the experience for our Ponyard to bring him up to scratch. Take that. Oh, that was a good hit. Absorb, that's fine. We're going to take it out with Pursuit on the next turn anyway. Don't call for help. Unless it's going to be a shiny Zubat. Oh, it's not shiny, is it? Is it, mate? But hell, we'll kill this one. And we'll kill the other one. And then we'll laugh. Easy peasy. Level 23. <gasps> That's our Magikarp. Oh boy. Okay, we avoided the attack from the Zubat. Uh, I mean, actually... I, th I think Pawniard can do this. It's only a Zubat. Nothing Zubat's going to do is going to be very effective on Pawniard. There you go. Look at that. Barely took a HP off. So then we'll go with Psycho Cut. Which will be super effective. There's the Astonish. Okay, here we go. Psycho Cut. Super effective. That did pretty well. I'm not worried. You can use Bite. That's not going to be very effective at all. Might flinch us though. Yeah, okay. Don't call for help. Oh. No, 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 no. Oh, okay. Okay. I know when I'm licked. Right, Herdia. Over to you, kid. You can do this. You can take everything out. There's the absorb. Took one HP off. And let's go for a bite on Zubat number one. Lovely. Hey, level eight for Ponyard. Supersonic, and it missed. Let's go for a bite on Zubat number two. Oh, look at that, beautiful. Easy peasy. Level 9 for Ponyard. Wants to learn Fury Cutter. No thank you. And everyone else is pretty good. And now Magikarp's going to evolve. Beautiful. Bum, 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 bum. This is fantastic. What an important member of this team this is going to be. Hell yeah, we got a Gyarados. And it now has an English name. You want to learn something? You want to get added to the Pokedex first, okay. And we completed a page! Jolly good. So Gyarados is the atrocious Pokemon. A tale is told of a town that angered Gyarados before the sun rose the next day. Flames utterly consumed the town, leaving not a trace behind. So don't make it angry. And it wants to learn bite, of course it does. There you go. Thanks, Gyarados. Crazy, we already have a Gyarados now. I want to get out of this place now, though. ASAP. And there we go. We have left. And there's Ilima, who we will talk to in tomorrow's episode. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this one. Of course, if you did, hit the like button. Hit subscribe so you never miss an episode. And until next time, I'm Ace Trainer Liam. Keep on training.